Well, welcome to the episode today. Uh, today I want to talk about work and people who work, I don't say work for me, people who work with me. Um, we just hired a new intern, which is really, really exciting, but I want to, I want to talk about that. I want to talk about interning, not, well, I'm going to talk about interning for me because it's what I know, but I mean, interning and getting jobs in general. I think that's about it. Okay, so this episode is all about work and worth ac work, work ethic. That's the word. Thank you. Work. He's an intern. Work ethic. Um, so this is Cole. He's our intern. I'm Cole. Hi, Cole. Hi. So he he did something very interesting, and I want to like give you guys some work advice when you're applying for a job. Is like don't ask what I can do for you. Like a lot of it. Like you started out with I love to help, not. I want to learn, I want to use this piece of equipment, I want to do this. And it's very important to do that. Because if, what are you, what am I going to give, what are you going to give to me if you're just going to learn? But you opened up with, let me help you out, right? Was that instinctual or is that just... Okay, so I think part of the reason I said I want to help is because I have that servant's personality where like, right. I'm always down to do something for someone else, right. I always want to learn by helping. See, and that's a good technique, not a technique, but a good thing to have is because then I'm not just giving you shit without getting stuff in return. It's yeah. very mu mutual. Like the other day when we were working on this, doing some routing stuff here on the audio system. Mm -hmm. but, <laughs> by the way, guys, I don't know, can you see, can, can you, you can't see him, that's his butt though. Um, there he is. This is Cole. We're bouncing ideas off of each other. We're troubleshooting with each other, and it wasn't me figuring it out. And you're like, I don't know, bro. No, very fucking plug that in somewhere else. <laughs> but like the first time that happened, like like that's why I don't bring on certain people. I'm not gonna say <laughs> names or places. <laughs> the reason I don't do that is because some people are like. Their personality isn't right, and I'm a, I'm a big personality guy. I think you imagine you are too in terms of working with people. You don't yeah. work with an asshole. No, I right. I don't know why I'm working for you then. So, anyways, <laughs> that's the episode today. <laughs> <laughs> um, but since you've worked for me for like a week now, mm -hmm. how has it been? What has it been like? How stressful is your job? Right now, it's not too stressful. You'll hit me up and be like, yo, come and figure this out with me. I'm like, well, shit, I'm in bed, I'm in pajamas, but I'll head over as soon as possible. <laughs> I'm a good boss. <laughs> like, you called me over right. for that, and I was like, I... Yeah, you're so... I'm like, I just broke this fucker up from bed. <laughs> Holy shit. And and the best part was, is like, what I love about your work, worth ethic. Work, I can't say that today. Work, work ethic. ethic. <laughs> you got this. Usa. Remember your pressure points. Do I? I exercise. How about your boy? Musa. 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 21,000. What? <laughs> um, it's like, you, like, a lot of people will watch until you ask for their help. You'll jump in and get your hands dirty. Like that. Yeah. And which is. That's how you learn. But most people, I feel, won't do that. They'll wait around, they'll be scared to touch something, they don't want to fuck something up. So they'll be like, I don't know if I should help. But that's why you're here. Like, you know, like, I asked for your help. Help. Fucking help. <laughs> like, so, I think a big advice of getting a job, and you did a great job of it, that's why I wanted to show your face on the vlog, is... <laughs> is because you... You're not scared to get your hands dirty. I think that's a really good asset to have. Thank you for being on the vlog. Yes, sir. Get back to work. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> All right, what do you want me to do? Uh, this over here. So that's Coleman, and I just felt like I had to talk about, like, I've had three or four different people in the last, like, three or four weeks ask, like, can I intern for you? I would love to work for you. And it's like, sometimes it's a hard no. You know, like, I, I want to say yes. But I, just something like, 
it just doesn't feel right sometimes, and I'm all about the feeling. Like, I brought him on, and it felt right. Like, and, there, you know, he, he's worked in studios, like proper recording studios. Do you remember when I worked in a proper recording studio? Hey. Yeah, the band is here. All right, on schedule. Pretty good. And he, like, he gets me, like, he gets my head, and when people start working with me, it, a lot of people go crazy, because I'm pretty sporadic and everywhere, but that's why I, I have a team, is so I can, they can basically ground me, and not ground like a, like a parent. Sit beside Christian, I'm not happy with you either. What's this I hear you guys are not behaving today? Mommy told me you guys gave her a hard time, so guess what? Guess what? You guys are both grounded. Like, keep me grounded. That's what I was trying to say. They keep me grounded and making sure I'm not doing anything stupid. I, I, I think I just had to say that, that advice. And I think that's going to be the theme throughout this vlog. This vlog did start at, well, at least that talking part I started filming about an hour ago. And now I'm gonna go pick up a, a childhood friend of mine who I haven't seen in like two years, like before he even started vlogging. Uh, I'm excited. All right, we're finding a place to eat. That's Dwight. What's going on? We kind of grew up together, kind of. Not really, kind of grew up together, <laughs> right? I mean, there was a period where we were living together. Yeah, and uh, and now we're gonna go find a place to eat around here. We wanted to find ramen. We, we wanted to find ramen, but the uh, let's just go here. Let's go there. All right, let's yeah. go there. All right, let's go. This is not as nice as I wanted to eat, but that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> How are you? Just a little... Mm. Bro, it's like... what the fuck is that show? <laughs> it's literally just cats walking on a white background. He's sleeping. It's all been for the past. Uh, what is that show, bro? It's all been for the past ten minutes. <laughs> so, how have you been? Life could be better, you know. Hopefully, Florida's for the best. Yeah, I feel you, bro. I feel you. How's the food? It's good. Also, what the fuck is this <laughs> show? It's literally just cats playing. <laughs> how? Very entertaining. How do you pitch that show to the network? So what's the show? Just, I wanna watch cats play. Just cats playing on a house. <laughs> Maybe a couple of hands in the shot here and there. Yeah, right? <laughs> Pizza's actually not bad. That was all right. And let's make sure we don't get hit by a car. All right, we're gonna go get fucking A, these fucking Florida days. Yeah, we're definitely not. <laughs> Picture there was a roof over our head. <laughs> Four? Four? Oh, don't! This motherfucker left us with a key! Four? We're stuck, we're stuck in the fucking Two? 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 Fuck, dude! <laughs> <laughs> we might just have to walk. Oh, we Where might- Where do we work? In there? <laughs> we you fuck! Where do we walk? I don't know. Just get out of here. Whatever we're doing, just get out of here. Whatever we do. Oh! I'm gonna take you back. All right. All right. All right. Bye. Ciao. Well, uh, I just dropped off Dwight. That was Dwight. Like we kind of grew up together. It's a long story. That's not as exciting as it seems. Um. Anyway, so like you know, we were even talking about like growing up and how like we've known each other for. Like more than 10 years probably and it, you know it's funny to like we went back and we're like, ima like imagine if we went back in time right now and we like looked and we could like look almost ahead and like us hanging out in 10 years and a, a decade's a long time especially when you're young like me I guess I don't know um anyways and like you know we're talking about like opportunities that we've had and how we got those opportunities and how some of those opportunities were great and they're great learning opportunities and some of them were 
op opportunities that we thought were great and they didn't turn out the way we wanted them to or whatever. And I feel like the way that that Cole and I were talking about getting that internship with him and me asking what, or him asking me uh, how he could help rather than him wanting something out of it is like a very good advice to get a job. Um, and I feel like today was like, uh, hopefully that like kind of opened up your eyes to that and like, you know, we do look for interns sometimes and maybe this vlog here would help you write that resume or help you in that interview. Um, I just felt like I had to say that and a quick disclaimer is uh, I've never had a, like a real proper job. I've never really applied for a job, but I've like apply like I've had to like do um, bidding wars for stuff. So, you know, I have that experience of like I'm up against somebody else. Um, and those bidding wars are, are serious money. And I just had I just it's been in the back of my head since we got Cole on and since Parker's been really like taking a management role. Um, and I just felt like I had to share that here in this vlog. Anyways, it's 11 o'clock. I try to get into bed by 11. Didn't happen tonight, which is fine. I can adapt, but I need to end this vlog here so I can edit and then get, uh, you get it. I'll see you tomorrow. All right. Hey.